afternoon guys um sorry i did not post last wednesday i was packed with a bunch of stuff and i had got gotten sick um i'm better now tomorrow's gonna be easter i'm um, happy easter for all you guys that celebrate easter i gotta talk about a couple things first number one we have officially made a website either it right here or it'll be in the description it is a uh, merch merch by me or merch by dot me slash isaiah larkin and i'll have the link thing right here um it'll also be in the first link in the description um we have two logos up right now one is the flying pride logo on a on t-shirts only right now they're only on t-shirts and then i have a sweatshirt and they're on a sweatshirt and it's a picture like a, a hand drawing of me it's really cool. I'll put their forty or fifty dollars, I think. They're expensive because also they're hand they're hand drawn and they're not gonna be up on the website for super long, so get them while you can, as well as flying pride t shirts. Um so while I've been sick I've been working on that website. Um I'll be slowly moving things from Teespring over to that website, um, to the official website um but not everything from teespring is gonna go over there <sighs> okay and um i need to pick up fan mail i haven't done that yet i will pick that up as soon as i can maybe this friday i will do it because this friday um is my last day at school and then we're on break for like a week i think about a week and a half we're going to either, I think it's Santa Mon, Santa Barbara, Santa Mar Barbara or Santa Monica, one of the two, um, over break, so I'll do a vlog, um, while I'm there, and it won't be posted until after, I'll try to make, um, live streams also while I'm there, um, but yeah, so go check all those, uh, cool things out, and get excited for the vlog, cause Kali's gonna be hecka fun, I can't wait, I'm super excited, um, so, let's get into this so today's so today's video is going to be uh it's i'm going to be reacting to a youtuber that goes by the name of michael suzo suzio i think it is i'm sorry if i butchered your last name um he came out to his mom um and he's super sweet um it came on my recommended and i was like i need to get in contact with him tell him I'm gonna make a video and he's like oh that's cool go for it so shout out big shout out to uh, Suzio uh, or Michael for allowing me to make a reaction video as well as it's in my playlist on YouTube so if you guys want to check that out you guys can do that I love the lighting behind him the lighting behind him is like really cool okay let's start it for real this time in three Two. Also, I painted my white nail. One. Let's go. What's up, everyone? It's Michael, and um, <clears throat> I don't really know how to start this video, but I mean, by the title of the video, I mean you guys probably already know what it's about. He is slaying gorgeous. Oh my god. Yeah, I don't really have anything planned to say. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna kind of speak and then go yeah, as I go. I mean, speak from your heart. And yes, I mean. It is a coming out video, so I am gay and and I'm um, gonna do two things, which is number one, I'm kind of coming out to everybody, and then number two, I'm gonna be coming out to my mom, and I'm nervous, but let's we'll see how everything goes and yeah. So I knew I was gay since I was young, and um, I didn't tell many people at first i didn't tell anybody and then it wasn't until fast forward to middle school when then i s told somebody and then and then since middle school to present um it's only been a handful of people um i was always scared of how people would react what they would say what they would think of me um and so many things like i was trying to figure out myself also and really focus and know and accept that this is who I am and but I was worried too much what people would think of me and it would all get to my head and I was never really fully happy or never really fully myself 
because I was living closed off in this lie, I guess. It was being somebody else when I couldn't be myself. So I think one of my main issues was exactly that, like caring too much what people thought. And till I realized that, you know what, like I want to be myself. I want to tell yes, be yourself, everybody, and let them know who I am, because I accept me for me, and I wanted to be happy, and I felt like I was kind of living this double life, like I was Ooh, somebody I with that feels like living a double like one life. person with the people that Relate. knew I was gay, and then I was this living this other life with like my family and like people who didn't know I was gay, and at first I was like, okay, like. I'm managing this, like, and then after it just gets, like, man, like, I just want to be myself. I want to be able to post what I want to post. Um, I want to be able to say things I want to say, like, um, do things I want to do, you know, like, I just want to be able to be me. So it's kind of hard also when I really had nobody. It was just me, myself, and I um, didn't really have, like, somebody there saying like oh it's gonna be okay like or i'm here for you or whatever the case is like that support i guess and um dealing with this specific um thing of me being in the closet and so many times i would just want to be like you know what like this is who i am and just let everybody know but i was always scared and i'm scared of what other people think do it at the time or at least i felt like i couldn't do it at the time i just wasn't in the right place i wasn't in the right state of mind i wasn't so many so many factors that had to do with it and i was i was scared for so long and i wish i would have had that strength that courage before to Thank do you. it but i just let too many things get to my head or i let myself kind of mess with my head and just be like, oh, I need, I need to stay in the closet. Like, I can't tell anybody in. Just so many things. I mean, I don't know if I'm making sense, uh, but sense. I mean, I hope I you guys are kind of catching yes. along. And it's just, it's been a long journey up until now. And I guess I myself could say that I've grown, um, like, tired of living two mm, different reach. lives, I guess you could say. Like, I know that sounds maybe a bit weird. I don't know if you guys understand, reach. but... Yes. I just want to be myself 24-7 and not have to feel like, you know, I'm living this life as this person and this life as this person just because I wasn't out. So I don't want to make this video crazy long or anything, so I I gotta get into the big part of this video, which is coming out to my mom and I'm really nervous. I don't know if you guys could tell that I'm shaking, but I hope everything goes good. I hope everything goes positive and... She doesn't know what this video is about. She, I'm just gonna call her and tell her to come down to my room. How and she know is <laughs> okay, boo. Yeah, and then just go they with the always flow. Know. The friends always somehow know. See, but what happens? It's crazy. But, sorry, I keep like looking away. I keep. I I'm, keep you're nervous. Just, I'm just you nervous. Said. So you got yeah, it. Yeah, but wow, well, you got it. Here goes nothing. Yes. Okay, so this is my mom, my mom, and so she doesn't know what this video is um, about. Um, by now, um, I'm sure you guys do, but yeah. So let's pretend like like the camera's not there, but like basically, like I wanted to tell you like why like you feel like you don't really know me, and um, why like you feel like not connected to me and stuff like that. Um, I kind of want to get emotional. But, like, I wanted to tell you that, like, I'm gay. Oh, my God, her reaction. Oh, and, like, honey. It's okay, sir. Oh. Oh. Like, I don't, I don't really want to get emotional or anything, like, and stuff, but, like. Mama <clears throat> word of the like, year. Yeah, like, I wanted to tell you that and stuff because, like, you're always like, oh, why don't you? Why don't I really know you and stuff? And, um, because, like, obviously you guys don't know, and, like, um, like, I feel like sometimes I'm living, like, two lives and stuff. And I don't want you to do that. Um, I had an idea. I'm not a 100% surprised, but, I, of course, I was giving you this space 
to come out and confirm it. I don't love you any less. You're my son and I'm going to love you even more. That it's a, sh it's a weight lifted up off both our backs. Um, we are in this together. Yes. I'm not, I'm not against it. Um, I actually, it's make me part of that today. Let's live one life, which is our yes, life mom. together. Preach. I don't want you to be living that separate life as you're saying that you feel. You have my support at 110%. Mm. You have it at like 150% like for um, me. I, you're my son. And I don't, whatever makes you happy makes me happy. And you know it's it's a new world. It's it's something new to me. And help me go go take yeah. me step by step. You know, teach me. I just didn't know like how. I don't know like like I don't know like you would react like us just because like I don't know. And then, like I mean, no one in our family is really like like yeah or anything like that and stuff. But like I felt like it's been like kind of long overdue. But like obviously like it has to be when. Like at the right time and stuff like that. Right. And I just, I don't know. I want to meet this guy. Stuff, oh my God. But, like, I want to meet him. Time, so, but like, I mean, I'm glad if I don't He's totally like so much older than me, I think. So my son, I was waiting. I, I Like I said, uh, I wasn't going to approach you. I don't meet him. I it's, had a feeling. Yeah, it's amazing. Um, but I wasn't 100% sure. And like I said, cool I, I wasn't going to. Exactly. I, I was. Like down in the future. I didn't and, feel our relationship really close. In the future, a lot, future. A lot of it was that. Cool I wonder, wonder, wondering. Yeah. Is it a yes? Is it a no? Is, you know, or when, and even a when. When is he going to come out and tell me? I'm not against it. Like I said, and I'm, I'm, I, I will express it to the world. You are who you are. And I'm 100% behind yeah, you. Mom. Like, so yeah, that just so much more relaxed happened, than like, and, um, himself. I was really nervous, as you could probably tell, and um, I'm still kind of like, wow, did that really just yes, happen? Yeah, it did happen. But I do feel like this weight has been lifted off my shoulders. And so the reason I chose to make this video was not only for me, but for people going through things like this or similar, you know, just to let them know like they're not alone, that they could do it, and Hopefully they see me Hashtag doing it and alone. it gives them that like strength or that extra little, you know, push or confidence to, Comment to Hashtag know not alone. that it's going to be all right and, and, and to be themselves. And, you know, I just really hope it sends a positive message. And so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, it means a lot. I feel like I could breathe now. I feel like, like I said, this weight has been lifted off my shoulders and it just, it just feels so much better. And. Thank you, thank you, thank you once again. Love you guys so much, and see ya. Oh, I love that video. Oh my god, I love that video so much. It just, mm, it's my fair bit. Um, go check his YouTube channel out. It'll be the second link in the description. Um, if you guys like this video, um, share this video. Please share this video. It'll mean a lot to me, and it'll mean a lot to him that his message has is getting out to the world um go subscribe to him uh follow him in, on instagram i'll link that in the description as well um then as always fly high guys keep flying fly with pride let yourself be free let yourself be who you are flying pride i love you guys peace out bye have a fun day